Hola, mamacita. Oh, papi guapo. Oh. ¿Por qué están tus pantalones tan calientes? Porque tú los encendiste. Oh, oh papi. Por favor, apaga el fuego en mis pantalones. Set me up with? Jill, I don't even know where to begin. Kirk? Uh, is Kate here? I'm Katie. I'm right here. No. Well, these are for you. Oh, these are for me. They last forever. See, you'll remember this night always. So, Kate, Jill told me you like cats. Actually, it's Katie. No, not Katie, Jill. Jill told me you like cats. No, actually, my name's Kate. Never mind. But, yeah, I love cats, actually. I choreographed the musical Cats last summer for this community theater. So much fun, I had to follow my cat around for like a week to mimic its movements. <sighs> so, do you like cats? Hey! Can we roll down a window? Actually, no, they're stuck. Mmm, <laughs> mucho delicioso. So, Kate, uh, how was your nacho? Well, unique. Yes, unique. It's to be a secret family a recipe. So, Kate, you haven't talked much on this date. Why don't uh, you ask me a couple of questions and get to know Kirk? Okay. Why do you keep an unlit cigarette in your mouth while you eat? Because there's no smoking in here. <laughs> I'm sure. Kate, you're a silly girl, but lots of fun. Yo, waitress, oh! El Billo! Andale! So, Kate, how do you like this place? Well, when Jill told me to dress up, I thought you were going to be taking me to a nice Mexican yeah, restaurant. Yeah, ladies love this place. Usually leaves them speechless. My buddy Javier's over there. Sure has a classy little place. Pero que tu haces con este idiota? Even though I don't speak Javier's language, I feel we have a special connection. He's a great guy. Actually, his name is Javier, and he speaks English. My brother and his sister have been dating for like the past three years, and they're going to get married. You know what, Kate? I'll tell you what. You take care of this, and I'll take care of bowling. What? Two 
for one bowling night here at the Mega Bowl. Hey, hey, must be my lucky night. Kate, too bad it wasn't two for one nachos night at Javier's place. Could have been your lucky night. And then again, the night's still not over. The key to the great game is owning the ball. Like a fine woman that's not sure what to do, you have to caress it and talk its way to its path of death. Get into the groove, come on, come on, come on, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Yes! You know, I hear the key to a great name is despising the pins. Like they were ten horrible blind dates that you desire to incinerate from your memory. Whoa, little mama. Don't be in a hurry to lose the game. Just slow down and let Big Kirk show you how to handle that heavy ball. And that slimy creep kept putting his hands on me all night. It was awful. Jill, this was the worst night ever. Katie, I'm so sorry. I didn't know. He's so charming at the office. The office? What? N never mind. As bad as the bowling alley was, it was the end of the night that will creep me out forever. What happened? At the end of the night, I tried to escape. He followed me up to my door. trying to talk to me and before I could get my keys and get in he spoke the most ungodly words he said pull my finger pull my finger yes pull my finger it's all right little mama just give it a pull what happened next I can't explain against every sane cell in my brain I did the unthinkable. It was awful. I don't think I'll ever forget this night. I don't believe it, Jill. Finding a good guy, it's impossible. Well, Katie, it's too bad that it didn't go well. But I'm glad. Huh? Yeah, I'm glad because I met this great guy at the gas station who'd be absolutely perfect for you. His name is... Ha, ha, ha.